quick. I wanted to make this really quick video. Um, I recently, if you guys have not noticed, uh, KSI and Logan Paul released their own uh, drink brand called Prime. And it's been only exclusively in the U.S. as of now. It's going to be distributed throughout the world soon, pretty soon. But uh, I managed to get my hands on some Prime today. Your boy got to your hand. I wanted to try it. I heard a lot of good reviews. I mean, all the reviews I've seen have been good. Nobody has said anything negative about it. So your boy went out and went ahead and bought me all the flavors. Apparently, all the flavors are only available in the U.S. I got lucky. So I got all the flavors right in front of me right here. I'm going to show you guys. We got the uh, we got the Prime. Uh, this is the uh, what, what flavor is this? This is the grape. We got the grape right here. Uh, follow that up. We got the uh, the orange. You know what I'm saying? And then follow that up, we got the blue raspberry, which is, this one seems to be a big favorite amongst a lot of people. So, we'll see uh, if it's a favorite on my end. Uh, and then we got the tropical punch. I think this one's going to be my favorite. If I'm, if I'm going to guess, I do like tropical punch flavor. So, I think this one's going to be top. And then we have a lemon lime. I feel like this one's going to be the one that's going to surprise me the most. Just because of the fact that... When I usually think lemon lime, I'm thinking Seven Up, Sprite, like a carbonated drink. I've, you know, I don't I haven't had a drink that's lemon lime that's not carbonated that's been really good. So we'll see. Uh, the one that I'm like not, I don't want to say least excited for, but I'm like kind of like ah, uh, is the grape one because I don't usually drink a lot of grape. I do when I do, I really do enjoy it, but like it's very rare that I go out and buy a grape flavored drink. So, all right. So, we, how this is gonna go is basically I'm gonna try each and every single one of them, and then I'm gonna end up ranking them from my uh, mo uh like most favorite to least favorite. All right, let's start with fuck it. Let's start the way we get it, or the order we I showed you guys. Come on. All right, one. Got the grape. Okay, cool. Um. Cool thing about this is very low calories, only like, I think, oh, you guys can see that, uh, uh, 25 calories, so which is really good, uh, no fats, no nothing, 10 milligrams of sodium, very low sodium amount, which is really good, carbohydrates, 2 total sugars, is 2 grams of sugar, which is not that great, and then got like a bunch of vitamins and stuff, cool, alright, let's try it out, the grape. Mm. I'm gonna take another sip. This one is as expected. Again, it tastes like anything grape flavored, but it's more on the sweeter side of a grape flavored drink that I've had. Usually, the good, the grape flavored drinks that I have are less sweet than this, but it's really good. And only 25 calories. Yeah, I like this. Alright, uh, next I think was orange. Orange, I think, is just going to taste like regular orange. It's uh, I mean, like like a Gatorade or something like that. That's what I'm expecting it to taste like. I should have brought a palate cleanser. But um, I'm just going to go. And hopefully that works. It smells, it smells like a Gatorade or a Powerade. Again, uh, let's see. This one, this one is less calories. I don't know for some reason. I think this one and the lime one are twenty calories each. I don't know what the difference is in what ingredient is missing that causing them to be less calorie than the others. But these ones, uh, this one and the lime lemon one, lemon lime one are both twenty calories each. All right, let's try this one. Hold on, yo, this is actually really good. I'm not gonna lie. This is actually really, really, really good. Listen, um, this one, I was not expecting to be this good. It tasted, it didn't taste like any ordinary, like, orange flavored drink, like a Gatorade or like a Powerade. Uh, I don't know if this makes sense, but it, it, ta it has more orange to it. I feel like with a Gatorade or a Powerade, it's a little bit more diluted. You could taste it, but it's a little bit more diluted. But with this one, this one, it, it's pungent. It, it's a pun. It's, you could definitely tell. Like, you cannot mistake that for any other flavor. It definitely screams orange. So, I like that one. Wow. It really surprised me. Uh, after that, I think I had the... 
I don't know if I had the lemon lime next or the tropical punch, but we're gonna go with the tropical punch. Fuck it. All right. Uh, tropical punch, same. This one is the same as the other ones, as the other three, which is a 25 calorie one. Let's try this baby out. As expected, tastes like a tr tropical punch drink, but um. I would say in comparison to other tropical punch drinks that I've had that are not like a like a, a hydration brand, um, I would say I like this one better. It's less sugar. I feel like the other ones have a lot more sugar and you can always taste it. You always get this aftertaste of sugar, but with this one, it's very smooth, very nice. Yeah, I like that one a lot. All right. Now for the last two ones that I have, the ones that I think are going to surprise me are going to be the lemon lime and the blue raspberry. So we're going to start with the blue raspberry. I want to see what the blue raspberry tastes like. And then after that, we're going to do the lemon lime. Then we're going to rank. So let's see. It tastes... You know what it smells like? It smells like a blue Gatorade. It smells exactly like a blue Gatorade. But it, 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 it like, an, it, it, again, <laughs> sorry, I'm over here stuttering. But, like, the same way as the orange one was, as I explained with the Gatorade, the orange Gatorade is usually more diluted. This one just seems more potent in terms of it being, like, a blue raspberry. So, let's give it a try. Yeah. Okay. I can see why this was a fan favorite. I can see why. Again, it's the same situation as the orange. It's just it it in comparison to like a ga like a like a blue Gatorade, it it has more flavor. It has it puck it, it packs a lot um packs a punch. There's a lot of flavor in there. You know what I'm saying? It's not as diluted, which is really great. Oh, that's really good. That's really nice. Okay, let's switch it up. Last and unfortunately, it's gonna be the least because they nothing after this. So, but um, yeah, that's the uh, lemon lime one again. This one's the one I feel like is gonna surprise me. So that being said, let's get right into it. Hmm. Okay, this one doesn't smell as pungent. Smells like any lemon lime drink, but like a hint of lemon lime. It doesn't feel like it's like lemon lime. It's just like lemon lime. If that makes sense, but let me try it. Not bad, not bad, but I I had high expectations. Um, just going off the orange and the blue raspberry, just going off of those into this one, it, it's like it's you're going down in terms of like the the flavor level. Like they had a higher flavor, they had a higher potency in, in terms of their flavors, but this one had like a very lower. It's kind of like a mild, a cool little like lemon lime taste to it. Like so, yeah. Now on to the ranking. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, okay. I have them laid out in front of me. I got the most, the one I like the most here. And the one I like the least over here. Okay. Started off with the one I like the most. No surprise here. <laughs> Apparently it's a fun favorite for, for a reason. I really, really, really like the blue raspberry. Again, as I said, it's, it's the, the potency that made it stand out amongst all of them. Um... It was really good. It was really nice, very smooth, and it's just like it's something that I can like. If I'm thirsty, I can. This definitely will be a go-to for me. Um, next up, uh, on the same spec, on the on the same line of potency, we have um, the orange one. This one was surprising. I thought this was gonna be at least maybe in third place because this one it's just an average. You know, orange is just an average drink, but uh, it, again, I really do enjoy the orange Gatorade. It's one of my favorites. So and then seeing this, uh, this version is definitely better. The prime version is pff, prime is definitely better because it's just it just again more. It, it packs a punch. The orange taste packs. It has like it's it's 
it, it just hits you right in the taste buds, you know what I mean? So I really enjoyed this one. Uh, that's in my number two slot. In my number three slot, we got the uh, Tropical Punch. I mean, it wasn't... It wasn't anything different. It's the same tropical punch flavor that we're all used to. It's just more so it was um, it was less sugary, which I really enjoyed because a lot again, as I said, a lot of tropical punch drinks tend to be uh, have a lot of sugar, and usually you get that aftertaste afterwards on your tongue, which I really don't like. But this one is very smooth. It was very smooth. In fourth place, unfortunately, the one I thought was gonna surprise me and maybe be in the top two slots was the lemon lime it was i don't know this one was disappointing to me maybe as i drink it more i'll enjoy it more maybe stand maybe stand alone it was it tastes better because maybe i i just didn't like it because i had like remnants of other flavors from the other drinks um but um remnants of flavors from the other drinks that's what i meant to say but um I, it's not even that it's just the fact that it's just very mild lemon lime taste it's not as pungent, but it's all right, you know? Uh, it's, that's why it's in my fourth spot. And my fifth and final spot is the grape one for reasons because, A, I just don't normally drink a lot of grape flavor stuff. And when I do, it's usually like those little, I don't know what you mean, those little pouch drinks. And that's very rarely do I drink that now. Um, I used to drink that when I was uh, younger. Um, but, yeah, um, I don't know. It just, it, <sighs> let, me, let me make it another try. Maybe I'm wrong about this one. Again, I think I would definitely have to classify it in with these guys, like the top two, with these ones here, in terms of, oh, sorry, with these ones here, in terms of it being um, potent in its flavor, uh, but it, uh, but that doesn't make it really stand out because grape flavor is usually really potent anyways, um, so that's why it's kind of in the, in the fifth spot. So to go over it again, um, for, and sorry, <laughs> Switch this up. First place on my list, we have the blue raspberry. I uh, really enjoyed this one. Very smooth, very potent. Uh, second place, surprisingly, we have the orange. Again, potent, very nice flavor. Not a lot of sugar, which is great. In third place, we have the tropical punch. Typical tropical punch flavor. It just has less sugar, which is great. And it doesn't leave you with that. Like that, like that chalky aftertaste that normally, like, like sugary aftertaste that normally uh, tropical fruit punch flavor drinks leave you with. Um, and then we, in fourth place, we have the the lemon lime. Lemon lime was okay. Uh, again, it was just too mild in its flavor. That's why I didn't like it that much. And in last place, we have the grape, which. The same as the two first two spots in terms of potency, but it's just the, the great flavor is just a little bit too the outer like it's too overpowering. Um, I don't know, not my favorite. So yeah, that's why this one's gonna be in last place. But yeah, that's it, y'all. Like that's that's that that I've been wanting to try these drinks. I've really been looking forward to trying these drinks. I'm definitely gonna leave one of these out for now to drink, and I'll take the rest of these in the fridge. I actually ended up buying two of each just because I want to kind of come back and give a second review and after drinking these for a while it doesn't have to be like within a week or two weeks for, like you know because I can't just like judge them just off of like one or two sips so I want to drink them more uh, more casually and you know put them in my regular like what's the word? <laughs> put my regular like dietary schedule like in my, my, my regular diet um just, you know, when I need hydration, I just, you know, opt out for these every now and then if I'm sick of water. So, I'm going to do that, and I will check back with you guys in again after I've done that. And maybe, just maybe, there might be a rearrangement in the lineup that is in front of me right now, which is the blue raspberry orange, followed by the tropical punch, followed by the lemon lime, followed by the grape. It might be a change in order. You never know, but I just want to give them a little bit more time to kind of, you know, I want to get more acquainted with them, and then I can give a better judgment. But yeah, that's it, man. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A uh, little short, little banger. Uh, this has been your host with the most, The Essential Dose, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.